Check it this. There you go. You can just see how many are in there. Hey, this is this is what wet spot does to your hub. They just they just completely destroy it. I think we've been fortunate now. That we've that. saved this at the right time, yeah. and uh, we did a, a removal from a chimney which we'll put the link up for you to go and have a look at if you're interested this this hive is not looking good there's wax moth inside it and there is a swarm of bees there so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna have a look and see if we can see a queen some eggs we're gonna move them into a smaller box a small box over here hopefully eliminate the wax moth then but generally when we see wax moth in a hive it means the hive is already dying and um, it's, there's not much hope for it but uh, let's see what we can do hopefully we can save these uh, ladies and get them back up to strength again there's lots of wax moth you can see all of this here has wax moth so it looks like there's just bees on these these two frames over here um, lots and lots of wax moth let's pull this one out and have a look We've got some brood on the other side there. Is there? Okay, and there's some brood this side as well. Yeah. Do you see any eggs? I'm looking for a queen, I'm looking for eggs. Show man, these guys are so small. Ah, uh, oh, there's the queen there. See the queen? She's just going behind the elastic. That's where they are oh, there, yeah, crawling around. As you can see, oh, she's got uh, mites on her actually. Yeah. So we might be able to save this colony. We're going to put them into a smaller box. I'm going to feed them up, get them, uh, get her laying. She's got a little bit of brood, yeah. Frame, mm. This frame's got quite a lot of bees on it. There's lots of wax moth here. Mm. Oh, look at them there. Eh? Okay. There's quite a few bees this side. There's a little bit of brood. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to feed them a one to one. Try and get this queen laying. One to one off? Uh, sugar syrup. Mm. One to one generally gets the queen thinking there's a nectar flow. She'll start laying. I'm not sure I'm going to move any more of these frames because yeah, the wax moth has just taken over. Wait here, this frame at the end of the bed. So we want to. Oh, these wax moths are everywhere. Pleased that we're going to be able to try and save these guys. Check at this. There you go. You can just see how many are in there. Hey, this is this is what wet spot does to your hub. They just they just completely destroy it. I think we've been fortunate now. That we've that. saved this at the right time, yeah. Some moth lava mm -hmm. crawling around down there. Mm -hmm. Okay, we know we've got a queen in there, so that's good. I've moved these guys into a smaller box. I think they're going to be happier in the smaller box. We'll be yeah. able to grow stronger, and hopefully, with them getting stronger, means they won't get wax moths again. Hopefully. Okay, you can see this one is tiny, and this one. They seem quite clumped. Very, in the very, there. very small. So I want to just check this frame here. 
There's a few bees on it. Take that one out. Put it on that side, John. I'm going to move these across. You got these last two frames? Yeah, these last two frames. Yeah. Show me. Yeah. It's empty. It's empty. It's actually got wet, man. It's a good thing we're taking them out. Got the wax moth in there. Is there a wax moth? Oh, there's a, uh, one of the wax moth lava down there. See it? Bottom corner. Oh my god. There you go. Okay. Quite a few here. And I'm going to take these three frame suckers. They're going to be super happy because they've got a queen there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that there is a frame full of uh, nectar, pollen. So that's what we call a resource frame. This is old comb that I put in for them. Okay, this frame here, got a lot of brood on it. This is all brood. There's a whole lot of brood that's um, still larva. Uh, down in the corner here, we've got quite a bit of pollen, but I'd call this a brood frame. This is all brood on this side as well. So that's a brood frame. This colony is going to expand quite quickly. That's more brood. Fully capped brood there. And that's brood on that side as well. Okay. Just having a look. There's some, there's some brood on this frame, not much. Oh, there's brood that side as well. Okay, so there's brood. It's another brood frame. That's also brood. Nice brood on that frame actually. Um, this is fresh comb down the right here. And that's all brood as well. So they've built that frame up quite nicely. That's not a bad frame. Okay, and the last frame. So normally the outside frames are going to be resources. This one's got a bit of resources on. There is brood in the corner here. Brood in that corner. Oh, and there's, that's all brood. And you can see there. That's actually quite nice. That queen's laid almost in every cell on that side. So with this colony, what we're looking at is one frame of resources, five frames of brood, and the queen is laying really, really strong. Thank mm -hmm. you.